Damon here is IGN News. In a meeting on the future of space exploration and research, NASA met with the Congressional House Committee on Science, Space, and Technology today in Washington. Among the many items discussed, both congressmen and representatives of NASA brought up the future of space travel, particularly in the context of a manned mission to Mars. Former NASA Administrator Mike Griffin suggested a gradual build towards space exploration and travel, recommending the moon as an ideal testing ground and telling the committee if God wanted us to go to Mars, he'd have given us a moon to practice on first. Griffin laid out a hypothetical in which astronauts would first spend some time on the space station before living on the surface of the moon for six months, thus providing astronauts and researchers with more information on how to better equip future travelers wanting to visit the surface of Mars. Astronaut Eileen Collins built on the idea, suggesting privatization of space travel to the station could create opportunities for the layperson while also providing NASA with the ability to venture even beyond Mars. She said, There are plenty of tourists and people that have money that would love to go up in space and live on the station. If we could find a private company that would take over the station and sell it like a hotel, we may be able to wean ourselves off of the space station and get into deep space. For more news from space, stick with us here at IGN.